What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and today we are taking a look at the new stuff that is coming on the 15th of December which is today. Uh, obviously the server is still down as you see there you can just play trial matches or whatever at time of recording this but it should be back on at about 8 a.m uh, utc so yeah the the server should be back on by then but what are we going to be getting so this seems to be kind of confirmed now what we will be getting with the festive season campaign kicking off this was already uh kind of one that kicked off like the last two weeks as well so there was a special login bonus where you got five french players so this seems to be a little bit more i would say better they're kind of mixing it up a bit so they say that they're holding a festive season campaign to celebrate the end of the year of an amazing year and the beginning of an even better one get your hands on login bonuses and rewards and also join in the festivities of the football festival so it's kind of the second uh the second football festival kind of like uh event or tour events or whatever it is going to be so this is going to be starting from tomorrow the 15th to the 12th and it just says we'll be handing out a special new year present to all our esteemed users so don't miss out and then they are the period so you're going to be talking about a four week period same as the last one uh so you're starting tomorrow from the 15th of jan or 15th of december to the 22nd 22nd to 29th 29th to the 5th of january and then the 5th of january to the 12th of january and that's it so the login one all the way is going to be repeated so every week this is what you're going to be getting you're going to be starting by getting your login one tomorrow which is going to be a legendary worldwide club chance deal and then day two day three and day four you're going to be getting twenty thousand gp day five you're getting 50 fo e football coins and day six and seven you're going to be getting another twenty thousand gp each there's also going to be a special tour event the rewards will be boosted during the campaign period period so make sure to take advantage of this opportunity accumulate six thousand points during each campaign so that's basically just getting match points within the game uh with this tour and earn a maximum of two hundred and fifty thousand gp um, and it says enter the european club championship tour event and earn awesome rewards and that's for the next two weeks and then it says that you can earn another thirty thousand during each uh thirty thousand xp during each period as well in the worldwide clubs challenge event so yeah i mean there's a load of stuff here man there's a load of stuff it says that there's a festive season if you clear all objectives and earn a maximum of five hundred thousand gp uh, and forty thousand trainers and also that there is tripled experience points for any games you play in the events and the eFootball league so that's going to be experience points is only completed uh by gaining or by completing matches obviously you know you can't just quit at half time or whatever and get the points uh you have to see out the match fully so yeah look uh, to me i mean <sighs> This, this sort of campaign stuff, we'll get into this, we have a couple of videos coming where we're going to be talking about kind of like the direction they're going, the community um, and stuff like that, we have a couple of different things that we're going to be doing and talking about, but to me, I think here it's, it's kind of summed up in this picture, you're going to be getting four free legendary players within the next month, you're going to be getting 200 coins and 400,000 GP, that's literally just for logging in, you do not need to do anything for that. And then up for grabs then, you have 500,000 potential GP for completing the tour event, 500,000 for completing the campaign achievement, and 40,000 XP, and then 120,000 XP for the challenge event. So I do think that they are kind of ramping up the rewards and ramping up for free-to-play players. They are really benefiting those that are actually like, you know, like playing the game regularly, um, trying to retain people logging in and stuff. I do think that it's a good idea to have these campaigns, but I would like to see them tied to the match pass a little bit more and objectives and stuff. We'll get into that in a future video. This is just kind of a roundup of today's news. We also have three new players i will be doing a quick review on them as well these are going to be called epic captains or epic great captains these are the next epic cards we've got big time stoikovic we've got gerard and we've got parchi sung uh, another three good players uh obviously these players are going to be on b form we will do a quick review on them and then last but not least we do have new match pass items a new match pass uh coming in in its uh it's in in its entirety so this is going to be a brand new match pla match pass and again as usual you're going to have the regular the value and the premium right so this is kicking off um with the regular match pass and you're going to get a combined total of 117,600 xp as well as three star nominating contracts you're going to get two of those four star nominating contracts you're going to get one of those and five star nominating contracts you're going to get one of those as well as a contract renewal as well so that's just a regular match pass for free everyone is going to be getting that for free so when you couple up this match pass just for playing the game right 
you're going to get you're going to be getting a free five star nominating contract and you're going to be getting four legendary players 200 coins and 400,000 gp literally for just logging in and then you know obviously you link that up and you sync that up with, by just playing the matches whether against it's against ai whether against online opponents whatever if you buy the value match pass, you're going to be getting a bonus player, Gavi. He's going to be a highlight player card type. That's going to be very interesting. You're going to be getting 128,000 XP, 200 football uh, coins. And then you're going to be getting the same nominating contracts, except you are going to be getting... Or no, it's the exact same nominating contracts. And the premium match pass then as well, you're going to be getting bonus player, Makuko, who is obviously the German uh, international and Bayern Munich, or Borussia Dortmund guy. And I think this card could be massively OP as well as the Gabby card. Uh, you're going to have 302,000 XP, 300 eFootball coins. And then you're going to be getting double the nominated contracts for a 5-star player as well as 4 3-star and 2 4 star. So there's a lot there if you are looking to get the match pass. Obviously, the match pass um, is going to be 50% off if you have not bought a match pass already. But if you have bought a match pass, uh, you can get... You can get it for 500 it's gone up to 500 and a thousand so the la if you haven't bought a match pass yet if you've never bought the match pass you can actually get one for 50 percent off uh which is you know you'd be able to see the price being 100 or yeah half 50 percent off basically so it'll be 250 for the value and a thousand or 500 for the premium but if you haven't all or if you have already got the the match pass or the value match pass with the last match pass which had Garrett Bale and Tadic I think it was in it um you will get the premium match pass for a thousand coins and the value match pass for 500 so it says it there so that is pretty much it for me lads I will just keep it short and sweet there we will have our thoughts on a couple of different things um when we're going going forward with the game but as you can see the server is still under maintenance when that comes out of maintenance uh you will be able to get your login bonuses and you'll be able to get all that good stuff uh, and start from the new well the new campaign is going to be starting today um so yeah i mean look there's a lot to talk about there's a lot to discuss they seem to be given a lot of stuff i'm of the mind that the mindset that i still think that they should be you know making these as part of the kind of like I don't know, like part of actually playing the game a little bit more, having more in dynamic, um, you know, like objectives and stuff that you're able to compete, you know, tie them to maybe, um, you know, building squads and competing in certain challenges against users where you can't really circumvent the, the team strength and all that. But we'll get into that in a future episode, um, a future date. But yeah, that is it for me, Les. I will be back very, very, very soon with another player review of the Epics. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe. Let me know what you think of this. I mean, we're getting four legendary players. Like, it's guaranteed... Um, I don't know, man, that's that's a lot, but uh, it's great for people that don't have legends, and I think it's a great login bonus to keep people playing, definitely, especially with the coins as well, but let me know what you guys think, I'll be back quite soon, good luck.